Hey everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome back to Hylix. Uh, I ran in here because I was escaping from the ambulatory skull. I don't know what's in here though. I'm such computers. Oh! Sigma siblings, brace siege of brains and sage of death. Well, I've already gotten two of those. And it just makes the weird noise. That trash can only had another parasite crystal in it. And that actually doesn't lead out. So, um... I think this place is cleared out. Oh, sweet mother of Jesus. Oh, right, I forgot to heal. Despair puff. Oh. <laughs> that was a little annoying. Mystic meat. Oh, perfect. So it looks like damaging them will wipe them up. That's pretty standard. Wow, cool. I'm not doing a bad job. <laughs> Perfect. Muscle up leak? And they won't come further. Oh, I'm... I was hoping I could escape. Ah, well. Let's go and use that dynamite. I'm yet to use it in battle, but hopefully this will remind me. Oh, you can stomp on your own things. That's kind of funny. I'll let you check it out first. Thanks, dancing man. Uh huh. Okay. Calibration. Oh, they used calibration before. I saw it. Cool. Makes it easy. So it looks like only Wayne actually gets upgrades. Maybe? Because everyone gets spells. That I know. I can tell that as much. Um, yeah, everyone gets spells. Wayne is the only one to get the upgrades from the paper cups, I think. Oh, man. Okay, so now he knows a blade of hollow pleather. Okay, cool. I think we're done with everything here. I didn't knock over that one thing in the little maze, but that shouldn't be too much of a problem. So now, can only be boarded from a dock. We can leave. Cool. So if we dock it here, that does nothing. Okay. Hello, sir. The boba link said noonday sing more softly than the softest flute. And lighter and lightlier than the lightest flute, the fairy timbres ring. You're a salesman. Squirrel food. Sure are selling me a lot of stuff there, sir. The core of a successful roach farm is a quality roach food. 
probably nuts and things. Ah! Is this... Oh, man. <laughs> I used to make claymations. I feel like I could make something like this game, and I would really like to. It seems really cool. And fun to make. Ah. Okay. Horn, squiggle, loop to loop, snake, and meat. Horn, squiggle, loop to loop, snake, and meat. That's the loop to loop. That's the meat. That's the horn swirl. <laughs> of course. I'm called Pongorma, greatest of the dread knives of Yithorn. Through long ages I've waited in this vault. Fight me. Nope. So it goes. Oh, Dark Flame. Cool. I suppose it makes sense that enemy attacks would be recycled for the player. Okay. Because those high quality animations only come so often. Prepare yourself. And he's got guards with him as well, of course. Dark Flame. Damages all enemies. Temporarily increases might. Um. Hmm. Let's. Hmm. <laughs> the little do 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 with the fingers. That's pretty good. Dark Knight falls asleep. They're all asleep. Cool. Let's try card A. Oh, fuck. I hit the wrong thing. Perfect. So because they're sleeping, I have time to get this in. Perfect. Let's calibrate Wayne again. And then we'll just have him stack damage. 82. God damn, hell yeah. Fuck, I forgot that does. Oh boy. Alright, you just go. Let's try and poison him. Dark Flame. So if I remember correctly, there was a thing earlier that was like... Uh, the Dark Knight can attack the... Um... Oh shit, that makes him immune to it. Hmm. Mystic Meat. Oh, it's everyone, that's useful. But yeah, there was a thing earlier that said that ambulatory skulls could only be slain by the Dark Knight. Or something like that. Damn. He's still guarded. Uh, let's keep buffing Wayne then. God, that damage is great. Cool. Oh, nice! 2,000 bucks! I'm defeated. I'll follow you and aid in your violent endeavors. Yeah, there we go! Okay, cool. 
Is this literally going to be that meme of the boss when you fight them versus the boss when you unlock them as a playable character? Let's see what Punk Roma has. Partial Destruct and Ancient Odor. Joyous, huh? Inflicts jolly damage. I believe that's a reference to the sword of Charlemagne, I think, which is called Joyous. Joyous? Artificial bicep. Or some shell. But, wow. It's upon Norman? Wow, he already has some pretty good stuff, considering. Um, cool. Let's watch this again. Cool. So now we can go... We're done here now. But we can go fight the uh, skulls. Okay, hello, sir. Lever's off limits. Don't recommend the button either. Please don't touch it. Stop pushing the button. What are you going to do about it, old man? I'll give you these muscle up leaks. Just stop pushing the button. Almost like burning mirror behaviors. Sigh. I really like the animation of the button. Extrude button fire accidentally impeded. You're a button pressing maniac. Take this. Now go, there's nothing more for you here. May you shun in oceans. That is worth it. I will take this and be gone now. Alright, so we unlock the boat. I always love moments like this in RPGs. Like, it goes back to, like, Final Fantasy 1 of unlocking the canoe and being able to travel around the water areas. But, like, it's nice, you know? Will up. Nice. Alright, now where to? I want to see if it's possible to get to some snow snus place. That's a big TV. Hmm. Inserted sage token. <gasps> of course. You bring the sage tokens here and it turns on the ultimate TV. It's currently dormant. It's pretty straightforward, honestly. Okay, so... We weave our way through here. Mm -hmm. What the fuck is that? Oh, let's fight it. Despair Puff and Ghost A and B. Oh, we fought Despair Puffs before. Cool. Take that. Oh. Okay. Oh, they drain your will from you. Try this. Let's give Jadis Mold a juice books. Let's give Jadis Mold two. God, that animation, though. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. <laughs> Flames. 
So Pon Gorma's attacks are really expensive, by the look of it. <laughs> oh, Pon Gorma's dead. Cool. Oh, shit. Oh. Would you look at that? And a warm burrito. Oh, man, this place, dude. Well, honestly, we might just want to go back to Samsonona. Oh. Perfect. And this is a map of the graveyard, then. Okay, let's go try find to... Let's go try to find Samsonona. Since there's no way to get to that middle island right here... I imagine you have to quick travel, or not quick travel, but you have to go through the graveyard and find a bunch of different little areas within. And when you go through the right ones, eventually you'll get to the place. So where exactly is his house? Hmm. Let's go here. Since if nothing else, we can just walk there. But also, let's try to find a skull, huh? Or we could die. Oh, you just kill him. There's not even a fight. Not what I expected, but cool. Useful. Alright, this will make getting through some snow in his basement even easier. The main difficulty is just going to be walking all the way there. Oh man, I really want to get it like a little green screen. Just make a bunch of weird clay animations and chroma key the background out. That is so my brand. I almost expected to have more to talk about, but like the game's very simple. Which isn't a bad thing. I kind of like games where you start with a party. Nothing against this game. Collecting the party members is cool and it teaches you more about the world. But like, um... A lot of D&D games do this, or uh, the earlier Final Fantasies. Where you just pick your party on screen one, and then that's the party forever. Which is... Oh wait, it's down from here. Which is nice, it lets you strategize that early. It's useful. I wonder what these squiggles are doing here. They don't appear to affect anything, but what do I know? They might affect more than I know. Oops. I like that it spawns you a decent way away from it. Alright, so this is... This is just in the little corner here. Alright, cool. I like that it's fucked up weird, like, 1990s vector graphics. Hey, Wayne. Oh, let's... Yeah. Let's watch this, everyone. Now everyone knows Bubbles. Cool. Juice box was found. Didn't I get that last time? Man, that makes it nice and easy. Acquired magic gauntlets. All right. Let's see what some Stona has. Demon skull. Poncho. Are any of these... They don't look to be better. Magic gauntlets allow the wearer to convert various creatures into mightiness. Interesting. Ah. Okay, Dossier. Holds dominion over the bug. She says this world is our lordly mandible and she eats ocean. 
Sure. Last of the Dread Knights, hark upon Groma's battle cry. Lordly mandibles shun our ocean. Uh huh. Mini leech. Okay. Is this going to take me to the grave? No, it isn't. Thousand dollars. Neato. So now we just gotta run all the way back. Oh, if only we could get the boat. Dying would also be a useful way. Man. So this is the party, huh? I don't even know how far I am into this game. Actually, I'll do this run off screen. And I'll cut the episode here. Uh, we filled out the party, and I believe this is everyone, so all we have left to do is to just find the main quest and kill the final boss, so... You know, when I say it like that, it sounds easy, but... Uh, I'll see you guys next time. This has been a very good game that you should all play, because it's only $3 on Steam. Please go play it. Shout out to Mason Lindron. I've been Alfred. Have a nice day. See you next time.